Must be afraid of the good old RPS. I, even for me, I don't, I don't remember last time I RPS. Really? I, I would just. I love playing RPS because, like, if I win the stage select, I've already won one engagement between me and my opponent. Momentum. Yeah, taking that momentum all the way into game one. Yeah. So I wonder what stage we're going to get. Are we going to get the Con Con Classic? No? No? Not hyping himself up? Not mashing the button? Oh, he dropped his controller. When you get too hype. Yeah. I was expecting, like, the, the million inputs of Luigi, but I guess he doesn't have to practice that anymore because, like, the... There it is. The tornado's gone. He just, he just did it. Oh, he did it? I missed it. Dang it. <laughs> My favorite part of his of him picking Luigi. <laughs> Dang, that's so wild that Luigi Fireball is better against uh, the Cross than uh, the uh, Villager Lloyd. Yeah, Villager Lloyd. Oh, the Cross just eats up the Lloyd? It goes through the Lloyd. Oh, that sucks. It's so bad. Wow, he didn't hit the Cross back. Well, that makes sense, though, because it is projectile, so it's projectile durability. Priority, yeah. Ooh. But like it's just, I think it's cool too that like you hit it and then it like auto goes back or it's like so sometimes it disappears too. Like, I oh know it went back. Maybe it looked like it disappeared at that time because he was so close. Mm. Maybe. Okay, well, Hong Kong definitely. Uh, I want to say more fireball heavy uh, Luigi than Elegant. I would definitely say a more patient Luigi than Elegant. Yeah. Elegant's very aggressive, even coming into to ultimate. Playstyle hasn't changed too much, or at least the game plan hasn't. Oh, that man. Max. Off the top. Would not be surprised if Nitro is first seed. And Nitro has done very well this season, now that I really think about it. And he has a lot of great wins and a lot of great places. Yeah, he even won Wednesday Night Fights last week. Yeah. He's been performing well at MSM when he shows up. Yeah, so. I definitely wouldn't be surprised to see him go higher up the the uh, PR. There we go. Cross. No, really water to catch from Hong Kong, but at what cost, man? You need the axe, too. Oh, I like that. Use the pr the plunger as a projectile Yeah. to kind of even out with uh, the Holy Cross and the axe. Yeah. It all just clashes in the air. That's pretty smart. Really good stuff. Hong Kong. Yeah, that, uh, that plunger is pretty good as a projectile. And I even like you, you'll see like Luigi set it up on the ledge to ledge trap mm -hmm. or like drop it down to cover like low recoveries. Pretty hype. Oh, oh man, man, dude, those forward airs are so strong. It's just such a right now Nitro is doing such a great mix of projectiles and that that mid range whip, man. It's just so good. That's honestly when Nitro's at his scariest too. Is when he's not just relying on like one set of his tools, but he's actually weaving in and out. What was that? That looked like it was gonna break a shield. Yeah. Like that as tipper S smash with especially with the holy water. Yeah, it definitely looks like holy water like shield poked that. Cause I know uh tipper F smash acts as an auto shield break. Oh. Yeah, it's that's pretty, disgusting. It's pretty disgusting. So if you like normal get up into an axe, they just like force smash in. I like the delay from Nitro, but ooh, holy water into F Smash, the classic. Uh, are we about to see a three stock against Mr. Con Con? No. Okay, the trusty tornado coming in clutch for Con Con. Yeah. No three stocks. Again, I I don't know. I feel like people don't know how to DI that uh, tornado really well just yet either. It's like kind of like Rob up here. You gotta go down and away from whichever side you're on. Do you have to mix it up at the end too, or? Nope. Oh. Nope. Nope. Two stock there coming up from Nitro. Very dominating game number one. But yeah, whatever side you're on. So like they, they can't really move when they're down being like side to side. So right. you just kind of like see which side you're on. Okay. That's good to know. You just fall out of it or just like the correct DI to get launched? It's just the correct DI. Okay. So you should be getting flinged at like a 45. You saw how he kind of like went more up. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Here's a pick I wasn't expecting. I was expecting three to five games of take this and chucking fireballs, but wow. we got a spacey coming out. Mr. Con Con with the box. Wow. I'm very surprised. <laughs> Flabbergasted even? Yeah. <laughs> I 
Wow. I know you like kind of played Fox and Friendly in Smash 4, but like never would you ever see it bring out brought on attorney. Especially at a local. I would I've this never is like a move that you say for a CEO or Evo. So like the big tournaments coming up. I've never seen Hong Kong play someone other than Luigi in tournament, even in Brawl. This man's been a Luigi main for over ten years. Oh, well, he's having a better start here in game two with Fox. He was able to rack up a good amount of damage on oh, Nitro. Oh, yeah, for sure. I, I definitely think Fox is, uh, wins this matchup. Fox is... Most of the spaces do pretty well versus Belmont, in my opinion. Oh, there's the up smash with Kalos. Pretty high ceiling. Another one to run it back. Oh, but it's stale. Stale, boys. So what is it that uh, will give Fox the edge in this matchup? Your sh Besides Shine. Besides Shine... Uh, you pretty much just, uh, you're fast. You get up right up next to Belmont. So they can't play the mid-range game as much as they want to. If he shined that, uh, that axe, uh -oh. he was, like, super dead. But, uh, yeah, you, you just have the tools to, like, get up next to Belmont and, like, box them. They just don't want to get boxed. Okay, that makes sense. Right now, Konkon having quite the trouble killing right now. Cannot land his back here. But these up B out of shields from Nitro are keeping Konkon away. What Just kind of keeping that? him at bay. And that trade is not going to go in Nitro's favor as he gets launched too far. Not able to recover. Okay, there's the parry up tilt. But the up B and horrible DI on that. Should not have died. It's another <laughs> move you want to go like down and out. That makes sense. Especially want to SDI that one, right? Because it's like multi-hit. Oh, you wanted to wall jump? Okay, somebody hit. Oh, big damage though for Nitro. Dash attack will break the zone. Oh, yeah, it doesn't even matter carry. if you carry that down air, man. Uh, he just it, bounces up. Yeah, it, it's better. It's honestly one of those moves where it's just get out of the way of it. Let him land on the ground, and then you, you punish. Oh, so you want to spot dodge that move then? Spot dodge or just like roll. dash away. Dash away. Roll, you know. All right. Ooh, dang. Man, this is not looking, uh, not looking good for Con Con right now. Nitro kind of running away with this. Yeah, another up B from Nitro. Really, he's getting a lot of mileage out of that move. You typically see it like as a as a panic shield option at, uh, coming from Belmont, but he's just timing it perfectly, knowing when Konkon's just going to be a little bit too aggressive on a shield. Ooh, the back air. It should just be in there. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah is what that is double down? No. Okay, there he goes. I was wondering when Konkon was gonna like start dropping to off the ledge to try and challenge the tether recovery with Nair. Yeah, yeah, definitely something that you can do. Oh, there's a Nair, but it's not enough. Oh, oh there it is. The other yeah, Nair with yeah. Double jump. Oh, but he still saved make it. it. <laughs> he saved the jump. Dude, buff Fox Nair. <laughs> oh, please no. <laughs> make it a kill move too. Oh, Konkon is surviving some way somehow, but. There's the backwards aerial, and he will lose that game number two now. Nitro going up 2-0. Oh. Now, how do you feel like his Fox did versus Luigi? I think the Fox is just a better pick, honestly. But uh, it might just depend on, like, how he wants to play it. Mm -hmm. um, uh, it's, it's just tough. I, I, don't, I don't think Kalos was a good pick. Right. Just because you gave him a lot of room. I say, I and a high ceiling. Go, right. Yeah. I, I think if you did go Fox, you'd take it to something a little close quarters. But, I mean, it looks like he's just going to switch back to Luigi, which also I can respect. It is his comfort pick, so. Okay. Well, game three. Right now, score being 2-0 in Nitro's favor. Okay. Oh, there's the intangibility on that down B coming through. Oh, I like the up air, too. Okay. We got some, uh, got some tricks. Mm -hmm. Making great use of that tornado as a landing tool again. Beating out the options that Nitro was trying to put out. And even right there, wow. trading with the axe, but still pulling Nitro away from his uh, his zone. Yeah, Konkon's Luigi is so interesting. The canine actually stopped playing, and he sat on the couch, and he's just watching intently. He's just <laughs> he's so interested <laughs> in this Luigi. <laughs> now he's walking away. The call out. <laughs> Oh, the misfire. Was that a misfire or was it just fully charged? Um, no, it was fully charged. Yeah. But nonetheless, Konkon keeping it like fairly close here. 
We'll see who gets his first stock. It's such a big deal. And Nitro, as I say it, gets the forward tilt, gets the first stock. And just, you know, sticking to the game plan, Nitro weaving those projectiles with a mix of forward airs and back airs. They're being tilted oh, quite nicely. That sucks. He did not get hit out. He actually fell out of the down B. Hong Kong for sure needed that. Down smash though, it's Ooh. still not enough. Belmont's pretty heavy. Yeah, use the, or Nitro was forced to use his um, directional air dodge though, just to keep himself from going into the blast zone. That was just the green light for Kong to go off stage. Oh yeah, for sure. Kick, oh man, but there is the forward smash. The holy water going to the depths. And with the angle that the holy water was traveling, it almost looked like Kong was gonna green missile right into it. Oh yeah. But Kong Kong normal get up, get up into the holy water. We'll get followed up with the force smash there from Nitro. The quickest of wow. damage and that holy cross just extending the combo. I love the setup from Nitro. He got he got the uh, holy water at low percent. It's like, well, I could hit him with any move, but I might as well hit him with cross because it'll come back as well. So you're getting damage and you're like setting up for another situation. 50-50s and the mix-ups continue. Oh, the charge on the down smash. Not sure where Kong Kong was going to go. Oh, crossed them up, though. Nitro was not ready for that. Mm -hmm. But unfortunately, Kong Kong not in a position to punish the up, the whiffed up B. I love how Nitro's, oh, ooh, but there's a, wow. Definitely not Tipper F-Smash there. No Tipper needed. Yeah, no, no Tipper needed. Not Marth. Yeah. 